Okay, faced with a little dilemma here, I need to get some positive or some feedback on this idea before I go further. As you can see, this is how the engine's supposed to mount. The bolts from the engine will go right through here and bolt to this piece. Then you have your lower mounts, or I can't remember the name of these, these mounts out here on the, the ends. And then this tightens up here on the, the tube. And the other one goes back here. So as you can see, the engine bolts would go through these holes here solidly and then it uh, through the motor mounts right here. Now let me show you what the dilemma is. As you can see, the starter housing sticks out way too far. And also, this part is too wide for the current engine mounts. So either I make these longer, which I really don't like the idea of doing that. As you can see, this is already pretty long. The whole engine actually hangs on these AN bolts way out here and then the ones back here. But as you can see, I have these bolts threaded in. Imagine those were spacers and it would extend, as you can see here, it actually clears uh, over there. So, with that in mind, what is that gonna do to my thrust line? That's yet to be determined, so. In other words, the prop, the center of the prop is here. It has gotta be at a certain thrust line somewhere right in here. And it may be even with that tube, I can't remember. I have to get the plans out and look. But anyway, as you can see, that's what I've got so far. And if we put spacers under, put bolts here that would go through those holes and mount solidly to this bar, and then put spacers here, washers or something, uh, that might cure a problem. It's just gonna lower the engine down maybe, I don't know, three quarters of an inch, so. Think about that, let me know.